There's something in the water near military bases and it's not good. For years now, we've been telling you about a toxic chemical known as PFAS. It was in firefighting foam that the Navy used at Fentress Field in Chesapeake in the 70s and 80s. It seeped into the groundwater and made its way into neighbors' drinking wells. Well, the Navy has been working to fix the situation ever since. Today in Washington, lawmakers heard about the scope of the problem on a national basis. The failure to disclose such critical information showed a complete lack of care for the health and safety of the service members, dependents, and civilians that live on and around Patrick Air Force Base. In particular, we must do much more to ensure that people living on bases and near bases have clean water. We must do much more to remediate uh, legacy contamination. A lawmaker secured $60 million for a PFAS cleanup in last year's defense bill.